Hello, hello. <laughs> I'm your late host, Anon Jr. Well, late again. Sorry about that. Alright, oh, uh oh. Let me uh, get under a little bit of shelter here, and then, uh, yeah. Uh, sorry. Long, long days. Uh, I ended up being very late for work yesterday because my car wouldn't start. Needed to replace the battery. So I ended up staying very late at work to try to make up time. And that kind of cycled everything late. So I got to bed late and uh, I got about four hours of sleep. And then to make up some of the rest of the time that I was missing, I stayed a little later than I really ought to have today. And so I'm scrambling and tired. Let's, uh, <clears throat> let's head down and assess a couple of things right quick. Uh, let me grab something to stack up on real quick. Actually, that's not gonna... Sure. Hey! Thank you for the, uh, thank you for the bit. <laughs> Alright, uh, let me, uh, I'll bother. I, yep, did I mention I'm scrambling? I'm scrambling. Alright, so, <clears throat> if you remember last week, I was working on finding all the slime chunks on the island. Yeah, I taken a lot of time to grind out the uh, pad down here so everywhere where you see within the border of this smooth stone is my island and it butts up right against medics island over there and rests island over there and this is the the buildable space that I have um, that I have for my area after slabbing it all up I wanted to find out where the slime chunks were so that way when I built farms I could work accordingly. And I found about 11, 13, somewhere in there. Uh, so we got the original one that I found on stream. I started making smaller pads because it was getting a little resource intensive and uh, <laughs> I really could have used those as slabs instead of blocks. But once the water was on there, I really didn't feel like uh, taking that down. Um, walled in the actual chunk so this wall is on the inside edge of the chunk border if I hit F3G you'll see there we go <clears throat> so all these waterlogged slabs are slime chunks so I got that one over there I got those two right next to each other I got that one over there let me get rid of the grids uh, we got this guy over here that one over there that guy over there one more here and two more in that corner there. So uh, that does that does beg a few questions. Where do I put the slime farm? And what am I going to do in these areas where I've got other chunks? Because um, <clears throat> I do want to get a general purpose mob grinder going. Um, a different design than what Arcadius is using. A different design than what Medic is using. Um, it's going to take up a fair amount of space and I don't want to put it in a slime chunk because I don't want slimes taking up any of the hostile mob cap. Uh, so I'm thinking it's going to have to end up being in this corner here. Uh, my only concern is it's still close enough because we're... What, negative 53. Uh, then to get all the way down here, it's a lot. Yeah, so we're talking about maybe 100 blocks. That means that slimes will still be able to spawn in this area here, even if I'm down at that end there. So whatever I do here, I need to make sure that I've got an on-off switch 
so I can turn the slime farm on and off as as desired. Likewise for the mob farm I need to make sure that that has an on off switch so that way I can have one or the other running without one interfering with the other. I would kind of wanted to put the mob farm diagonally over that way but I, I haven't double checked the measurements I think what I want to build is a little too big to tuck into this corner here. Um, <clears throat> but I'll have to double check the measurements on that one first. Um, and then what I put here is going to be interesting. Uh, and I got to figure out what, what farms I can and can't put in some of these other areas. Because like... Uh, I don't want to put some of the tree farms that I've seen that would provide surfaces for slimes to spawn. Um, I could definitely get away with a cactus farm in one of them. Maybe a sugar cane farm? I don't... No, probably not. Oh, um... There we go. Let me unmute Discord now. Um... So i got to figure out what I'm going to do with some of these areas. I, I almost thought, <laughs> except I, I, I wouldn't have a good place to put a regular mob farm. I thought about turning this area into the slime farm. Have um, platforms in that double chunk there and platforms in that chunk there. And then set the killing area over here somewhere. But, uh, I don't know. I don't know plans and things. How are you guys doing? Good enough. How are you? Other than frazzled and uh, not sure what you want to do. Uh, frazzled <laughs> definitely covers it. And a little congested. I'm not sure what's up with that. Yeah, I woke up the same way. I'm hoping it's just a weather thing that's uh, well. been going through. <laughs> There's definitely been a weather thing going through this area. <laughs> How about you, Medic? How are you doing? Apparently, he went to go get his coffee. Ah, well, I mean, who can blame him? Um, I do <laughs> want, in addition to moving all the farms down to that bottom, I, I want to move all my storage down there as well. I'm even going to move the uh, cobble generator. Yeah, weather thing. We went from like 90 degrees to 70 because of the storm that blew through. The pressure from the storm itself, and then it, it's been stupidly hot again. Yeah, I don't think that covers it. <laughs> All right. Anyway, so I got to figure out storage. I got to figure. I got to move the cobble generator. Oh, that was the other thing I was going to check. I need to see my iron supplies. <laughs> my iron supplies, such as oh yeah, duh. Actually, had enough to make a block of iron. Uh. Let me cook up these last couple ingots. I'm not going to waste a charcoal on three iron ore. That, that's... no. Nah. You ain't about that life. No. I'm trying to get a hold of a bunch of smooth stone. Or, sorry, not smooth stone. Regular stone. Which way across? That way across? That's Medic's place. Unless you're talking that way across. That's your place. Yeah, Medic's been busy. He's building up a wall and a moat. <laughs> I don't know if I should take the wall and moat personally or not, but, uh... You should. Yeah, let's walk around this without falling down to our death. That would be nice. I'm going to need Oh, beautiful. 
Because one of the, one of the things that I I've got a top priority on top two is this cactus farm needs to get bigger <laughs> and get moved down there and I need to get that slime farm put together oh that could be good I mean if you uh, if you waterlogged the bottom slabs down there the flowing water would fall into the bottom slabs and wouldn't spread out from there so you could actually have a nice cascading waterfall that didn't, you know, flood your entire floor. I also see that he finally finished his uh, his entire floor there, too. Nice. Alright, um... Where was I? Slime farm. Cactus farm. I need... I'm probably going to need more lumber than that. Um, I think so. I think things spawn on slime blocks. I'm like... Oh, uh, I thought I had... A Yes, asterisk. You can you can die if you fall on slime blocks. You can also save yourself if you fall on slime blocks. It depends on what you do. Like if you if you land in a crouch, you'll die. If you're willing to let yourself bounce until you lose all your momentum, then you'll be okay. So if you're getting ready to get to what I think you're getting ready to get, where you, you build a giant platform like that, coat it in slime blocks, and then have a permanent uh, no folly damage. Uh, <laughs> that, 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 I mean, that is technically possible. I assume that's where you're going with that. I don't know about the fun part, we'll, but we, we can definitely go with possible. Um, okay. Distractions, distractions. My poor distracted brain. Uh, sticks and logs and coal. Don't throw that. What am I short on? Oh. Oh, yeah, because it is logs. Uh, I need three more logs. I also need to spend some time grinding out some more lumber. And maybe finding a few village people to... to buy uh, campfires from. I need those. I need... Water buckets. I need jack o' lanterns. I need at least two more brain cells to rub together. <laughs> what? Not bad, huh? Yeah. Um. So I guess part of. Let me make sure I'm standing under the walkway here, so that way I've got something over my head and nothing unfortunate appears. So I've got that area down there. I'm, I'm going to do that double chunk for slimes. Uh, looking at the different farms, uh, Nembomb did a wonderful explainer about how slime farms work, how to make them more efficient, how how... Everything works, and probably the funniest thing for me was he was going through the ascending order of complexity. Like, like your basic block that is just there, and then you got things that have certain properties, and then things that have more properties, and things that have more properties, and you, you, you know, kind of, kind of the, the, the evolution of objects where they get progressively more complex. 
And the funny thing about slimes is I didn't realize just how dumb slimes are. Like, they are literally just a little bit above armor stands. Oh. <laughs> they, they, have, they have no pathfinding AI. Which is why, unlike zombies and creepers and skeletons and stuff, if you get past a certain distance, they won't freeze. They'll keep jumping. Because there's no AI to freeze. Um... It also means that you can technically do a slime farm without having to have a golem for them to target. And, side note, slimes will target players, iron golems, and snow golems. So you could use any one of those three if you wanted to lure them into the killing area faster. But you can get some surprisingly respectable rates from a slime farm with a lair and a three block wide trench around the edges pushing them into killing chambers in the corners the one of the things that that's got me a little uh, is in nembom's example he used magma cubes magma blocks to uh to to kill the slimes um I don't know if you've seen my inventory, but I, I, I got something I'm a little short on. That's magma. Yeah. Good luck with that. So, I'm wondering if water, if water will, I'm wondering if I can make this work anyway. And find some way to push them towards a campfire. And have the campfires kill them. Now, one of the things that, that Nimbom also mentioned in, in his thing um, was he actually recommended not using a double chunk. But his rationale for that is the platform ends up being so big that you they don't randomly jump off to their death quick enough um, so I'm thinking instead of making one giant platform out of the two chunks I'm going to do two stacks of smaller platforms and then hmm. and then have them pushed into a killing chamber of some sort um, and then go from there uh, what I forgot to check is what the hitbox was on a slime. Because that determines a little bit of what I can do on this too. Okay, so the big ones are 2.8 blocks big. That means that a 2x2 two two hole is not big enough to kill them. Hmm. If I had a... <laughs> See, a, a, lot of, a lot of what I'm looking... What, a lot of what I've seen for farm designs all assume that you're in vanilla Minecraft and you have easy access to the nether easy access to the things that are abundant in a vanilla nether and, and a few and you know stuff along those lines um, so what I got to do is I got to figure out how I'm going to push these guys around and how I'm going to kill them um Which direction's my back there? Okay. Because what I might do. Oh, and the other thing that I need to figure out is I need to figure out how to make this something that can be turned off. That's something that I've not seen anybody do. 
Uh, the assumption is is that you're always in a world or in a setting where you wouldn't want to turn your slime farm off. You just want it running all the time in the background. And on a single player skyblock, that would be appropriate. On a regular multiplayer server, that could be appropriate if you built it in an area where people weren't all the time. Because if it was loaded all the time, then uh, you're, you're eating up all the mob cap on people. Which, which is you know, the reason why I'm trying to make sure that all my mob based farms here have some sort of an off switch because I don't want you guys getting sucktastic rates off of your mob farms because my stuff is eating up the cap. Just because somebody happens to be close enough. Um, I also need to pick on medic a little bit too. Hey, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Um, I need to pick on medic a little bit too. The uh, top of his mob farm there is in a slime chunk. And so while I was working on building and tearing down platforms in this area, uh, slimes kept spawning where that torch is, jumping off there and hopping over the border to attack me. <laughs> that was uh, that was a little less that fun. Huh? That was planned? That, that was planned. Uh, yes, I'd like to see the manager about a slime breaking loose and crossing over into my property line. That's, that's my border patrol. <laughs> How are you doing? Well, I'm doing all right. It helps if I have my microphone on. Oh, yeah. I, I, you were awfully quiet. I, I just figured, you know, you're getting coffee or getting settled in or something. And yes, yeah, Pink Geek, it, it is. Uh, we're, we're still on the island. <laughs> the island game. Well, he is still on the island game. I'm in Sim City over here, and uh, Medic is apparently playing uh, Medieval Siege or something. Uh, what was that tower defense game that was red hot for a minute there or two? Um, you used to get Reyes to build all your defenses all the time. It was one of those Zynga Facebook games back when Zynga was still, you know, <laughs> I, I know, they, they all run together at, after a certain point. <laughs> Pretty much. What's what's the recipe for chain? Anybody remember? Uh, it's a mixture of nuggets and ingots. I just don't remember. chain or chain -a? That's a good question. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I've got it. Thanks. It's a nugget, uh, ingot, nugget. Well, and there's a nugget of information we all needed. No. <laughs> no? No. No? Negative Ghost Rider. All right, so I need to... Yeah, so I need to figure, I need to figure life out. Ooh, I found a new dice company. Is this that same ad that a bunch of us seem to be miraculously getting from uh, Instagram? Maybe. It's not the one with the eyeballs, though. <laughs> this one was glass. You, you have a problem. No, I don't. You have a problem. I have many problems. Which one are you referring Why to? I just... Minecraft want me to log in. Minecraft has never asked me to log in in a very, very long time. Because they're rehabbing the login system. And so it has periodically logged everybody else out. That's annoying. Mm-hmm. It is. What's more annoying is all the whining and complaining from people who are going, everything was just fine. We don't need to migrate to Microsoft accounts. I don't want a Microsoft account. Uh, don't give me that security stuff. Well, I hate to break it to you, but um, A, it is more secure. Or, let me rephrase that, it has the potential to be more secure. People can be an idiot on any system. That being said, uh, assuming you actually follow, you know, anything reasonably approximating uh, recommendations from this decade, uh, it is safer. It is more robust. And uh, 
th think of it. Think of it for Microsoft's end. You you have two systems that log in and authenticate people and manage permissions accordingly. Um, one of which is modernized and secure. The other has been around since you acquired the company. Um, what are you going to do when it comes time to, you know, modernize your, your setup and solve some of the, some of the lingering issues that, that have been floating around with the old Mo Yang account. I get the feeling that Anon has a opinion on this. I don't know what you're talking about. He's never I, had an opinion about anything. <laughs> I, I wouldn't even give that kind of lie. And, and the funny, I think what really irks me about it is it's an irrational dislike of Microsoft posted on a tweet from their iPhone, which they had to have an Apple account to log into. There is no way to do anything with an iPhone without an Apple account. But Apple is far superior and more secure. Mm -hmm. So say it them. So say we all. Oh, wait. Different mm -hmm. franchise. <laughs> mm. Ooh, LastPass is multi-factor now. Mm-hmm. Yep. Uh, LastPass does, and, and that is one of the advantages of migrating everything to the Microsoft as account, is you'll be able to secure your uh, Minecraft account with multi-factor authentication. So you'll, you'll, it'll be even harder to, for somebody to, I don't know, hack your account, log into your servers and do crazy stuff with your stuff. They would never do that. Oh yeah. No, people would never do that. <laughs> I mean, we, we've only had three or four people try to log onto our server randomly. Oh, we really? really? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and, and, but here's the thing. I, I, I found I found that while I was trying to troubleshoot permissions problems for the uh, biome changes, and it could, I'm not entirely sure that it says malicious as you would think by that, because you've got two things that that kind of play into this, and, and it really, uh, who can say which is which, um. We are on a big hosting provider that has a large swath of IP addresses. If you know the hosting provider, you know the range of IP addresses that they have. Um, and just how big a range that could be. So it's trivial to start at the beginning and test every IP address through the range see which ones have an actual live server at the other end and then try to log in to see if somebody didn't secure it with a waitlist doesn't sound non-malicious <laughs> uh, well it, some people do it some people do it just to see some people do it with malicious intent they, they log into unsecured servers and, and start wreaking havoc um but by that same by that same notion, um, hi friend, I know I've ran out of pickaxe. Come on. Uh, by that same notion, uh, consider that you've got people using these servers who have never set up a server, or you've got guests of those people who might be struggling with logging in. So just as easily as it could be somebody scanning looking for open servers it could also be somebody uh, you know, fat fingering an IP address and typing in the wrong one you know they, they dyslexics a couple numbers or or they, they hit the number next to the one they were looking for and from our end there's no way to tell which is which I, I can't look at the logs and tell you, oh, yes, they're trying to break in. Or, oh, yes, they, they just made an honest mistake and, you know, typed a, a 
22 when they met at 21 or something. Hmm. All I see is that so-and-so's account attempted to log in, they were not on the wait list, and were turned away. Well, I mean, I, I can guarantee that we can figure out if it's malicious, if one of those attempts was made by, oh, I don't know, a, a geek that happens to be pink. <laughs> no, no, it wasn't anybody's name that, that was familiar. Um <laughs> And I wasn't about to go searching high and low through forums for for usernames and stuff like that because at the end of the day, there's no there's no point. Exactly. They didn't get in. Nothing happened. It's all. Yep. Good. Yeah, the whitelist did its job, and that's that. Yep. Oh, and uh. I meant to get to the spigot form to reply to the owner of the U Skyblock revised, uh, or revived, sorry. Because he replied to my question about the problems that we're having with, uh, with people being able to switch biomes. And this is one of the frustrations with uh, modded Minecraft in general. You see, Spigot, the server software, has a permissions manager for managing permissions. It's a little clunky. It's hard to work with. So a lot of people end up using a plugin to manage permissions. One of the listed required plugins for U Skyblock Revived is Vault. Vault's primary purpose is for coordinating permissions. And this already seems like one permissions provider too many. But apparently, most people play with a third permissions provider available. And it was just one of those things that everybody does and kind of forgets that anybody who's never done modded Minecraft uh, would ever think to, you know. So... <laughs> We're, we're going to need a third permissions per, permissions provider on the server. I'm going to see if there's a way to set it up or to make it work with what we already have. Because I mean, seriously, how how many how many providers do we need? A lot, apparently. Um. Yeah. And then, and then we'll once uh, once the permissions issues are resolved, then we will be able to finally switch biomes. Now, uh, what I didn't get a chance to talk to the guy about, and I'll have to figure things out, is I also noticed, incidental to all this, that. Um, Sorry, searching for the phrase. Oh, uh, that, that, um, there is no, there's no mechanism, there's no challenge that unlocks anything other than three of the biomes in the switcher. And that switcher doesn't offer all the biomes that are available. So when you go to change island biome, you see ocean, which is the default that everybody has access to. You got forest, you got desert, you got jungle, you got swampland, taiga, mushroom, hell, sky, uh, plains, extreme hills, and flower forest, and deep ocean. Challenges only unlock Deep Ocean, Swamp, and Jungle, I think. I can't... I'm blanking on the third. So out of that entire list, 
only you start with one, and there's only three others that get unlocked. So I, I get a. I will have to have a little staff meeting at some point this weekend. Uh, maybe maybe before maybe before D and D. Um, to to figure out if we. We have D and D. We didn't last weekend. It's been every other weekend. I'm just giving you a hard time. No. I, I'm having a hard enough time without you helping. That's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I'm having a hard enough time without you helping. But I'm here for to help. Yeah, yeah. I know. Just one of the services I offer. Mm-hmm. And I thought, okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. Um, um, if uh, if you guys go to the nether mm -hmm. and you accidentally smack a piggy, mm -hmm. please make sure that evening you log out. <laughs> uh, what happened? Arcadius? First off, I didn't smack a piggy. You smacked a piggy, and I just happened to have not logged off for the entire weekend. So I kept them angry at you. Oh. <laughs> oh, so somebody maintained so aggro. these piggies have better memory? Uh, yeah, they have really good memory. I thought they were supposed to forget after a period of time. Uh, if you're not keeping them aggroed... I, I I know. I know they forget when you leave the Nether. I know they forget when you log off. Negative. Um, Not if someone's sitting there with them, which I, I was. That's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> I no. lost count of how many times I died this weekend in the Nether because. They Someone has a piggy problem. The entire, the entire weekend. <laughs> oh, and they spawned more than fifty. Really? Oh, because 50. uh, because they're not technically hostile mobs; they're neutral. Oh, hmm. they were pretty hostile. I mean, neutral you can turn. Not. Uh, you can turn them hostile. Ain't nothing stopping you from doing that. All right. Um. Hostile, my tuchus. How do I want to do this? Oh, bother. I don't know. How do you want to do this? Well, if I knew that, I wouldn't be asking the question now, would I? I don't know, you might. Uh, that at least gets me way up here. I think the problem is, though, that if I get the bucket of water flowing, I can't remember if the campfire stops it until it's waterlogged, or if it'll flow over the campfire anyway. Is it at 7 or at 8 that something can spawn? I want to say it is at 7. So wait, nothing can spawn on the bottom layer anyway? Light level. Oh. Yeah. Um, unless you're like on a bottom, s unless you're on the bottom slab above the void. Yeah. Okay. So the water will stop at the campfires. Um.
That means that... I'm going to grab these real no. quick. Ha, ha. Go away, go away. Nobody likes you. Slab those real quick. <clears throat> and I'm going to go get some more cobble and a crafting bench. I'm a slice of coffee. Uh, I have coffee. It's not helping. Four hours of sleep there, it, and a full day at mm. work. I, I'm surprised I'm here. Sadness. I need a lot more cobble. Is there any way to make it like auto collect? Depends on what you mean. Like to make it just kind of like. So how to say what dozen I want. pistons you can sit and have it just make like slices of cake of cobble for you to go mine up later mm -hmm. yeah you can do all sorts of redstone magic that will push it into a nice block for you to uh, mine out later mm, um, I don't like magic if, like you, if you feel like playing with TNT there, there's you, you can do uh, cobble farms of all, all sorts of variety <laughs> Mm, that sounds complicated. I think I'll just sit here. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, you asked. Is there a way to, like, pull down my mouse button? Yes, there is. Ow. You exert pressure with the appropriate finger for the button you're trying to hold down. That's I'm thinking a thing at you. <laughs> I know. You're going to find those peppers in your coffee. It might actually wake me up. Oh, you want to wake up? We can do one of those live. Uh, that's a negative ghost rider. Oh, no. That could be a cute little... Uh, could be an award tier. You get to watch it. Yeah. <laughs> What do do like that uh, modern rogue pepper challenge where they had that poor dude in tears? Yeah, yeah, that one. Oh, I have a couple of random pumpkins. Get those guys. Can someone sleep? Apparently not, since, you know, I only got four hours of it. Really? Really, really. Oh, inventory. If only it could be larger. Yes. If only people had asked for that. Uh, oh, that's right. I needed to check something else. Ooh, I got redstone. Nice. More useless redstone. What do you mean useless? I don't use it. That's a shame. So far, I've collected uh, six. Ninety-three redstone dust and twenty redstone ore blocks. Would, would that be an embarrassment of redstone, or...? What is the collective noun for a bunch of redstone? Is that a lot? You guys gotta have more. Not yet. 60 dust in my generator and 2 dust in my box You're plus gold. 6 gold uh, <laughs> 6 blocks of it but also I have okay. a cleric that sells it so I'm not really worried about 
Oh, you got peoples too? Mm hmm. What did they trade for? Uh, everything a cleric will trade for, and then I've got a farmer I'm about to have a mason. Oh, more redstone. Hmm. No, he doesn't do redstone. He does quartz. No, which is I just found I more have. redstone. Oh. Yeah, if I had I'm a kind of mad about it. that linked me and uh, Anon, I would just decorate it in redstone. Just because I. Just because. Oh, that's a good idea! I could make the floor out of redstone! <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> That'd be cute! No. It's also what worth more. I'd get for that. Rarer block. I think it'd be cute. It could be. Mm, it could. Lots of things could be. <laughs> Ooh, do the redstone floor and then get those um uh oh. dark bricky things from um the sad place. Dark That'd bricky things. Together. I don't I didn't get that one either, I'm sorry. Medic <laughs> <laughs> or a Obsidian or a uh, cry obsidian, one of the two. And I'm pretty sure she's talking about nether bricks. See, more power to him. <laughs> <laughs> had nothing on that one. All right, so if I get the water going that way. That's going to be too big for the big slimes. But the little... Okay. Yeah. No. Are you hurting your friends? Hmm? <laughs> I... Also, what level is the slime chunk at? It is below level 40. To, to the very void. <gasps> Lapis. So wherever wherever a a wherever you find a slime chunk, it's uh, from forty on down to the end of the world. A silk touch axe. Because I'm actually tempted to drop all of this down to where the slab is to give me a little more, uh, a little more space to work with. Hmm. Don't you guys still want more clay? counting <clears throat> oh it really did grow that quick Arcadius, where art thou, Arcadius? Uh, slash I S space warp space Arcadius. Boop. I don't remember boop being part of the command. Well, obviously, you haven't been doing it right. Whoa, 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 whoa! Railing, sir! Oh, Java, she's not mad at you. Oh, poor 
He's he's slinking away to a further corner. <laughs> Why are there no railings in this place? Poor Come guy. here. Oh, poor Java. Oh, thank you. Welcome. Railings. Oh, your windmill's so cute. Thank you. Oh, you've been doing lots of stuff over here. Aww. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay. What? I can't go look around. Oh, here, open the doors for you. Where are you at? No, it's okay. <laughs> I'll look later. I got things to do. Okay. <laughs> How do I get back? <laughs> Slash IS and then click go home. Slash IS. Enter? Ah, yep. return home. Yeah. Now that I don't need them anymore, I get so many saplings. <laughs> Isn't that always the way? Art, how's your tea? Tasty. Oh, 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 almost. I'll oh, move this forward one more. big ones will break. Oh <sighs> my. Oh my? My melons are growing faster than I can keep up with them. Oh. More dirt for me. I'm about to have whole blocks of useless dirt. What is this useless dirt of which you speak? Oh, uh, well, it's the place where the melons and the pumpkins land. Um, That's useless dirt. force these guys into a position where they end up getting smaller. 
I, I need a way to kill the big guys w without making a larger killing bit because most of the most of the slime farms that I've found all seem to have a three by three killing pit or bigger um, with the exception of one il mango design that I don't not il mango uh, one num bomb design that I don't have the the resources to to do um So I'm wondering if if I get them into a spot like here. Except I think like I need. So? I think I either need this higher or this part lower. Yes. Once more, with feeling. I also have a bunch of black ink. I think we uh, need that. How much is a bunch of black ink? A couple of he stacks. He says with some trepidation. Just a couple of stacks. Just a couple of stacks? Why? Do you want some? No. I have nothing. Nothing I can do. Anything with black, black ink. And I have more than enough of my own. Probably for the same reasons. It wasn't intentional. Mm hmm. I kept trying to get fishies. Were the fishes that delicious? The fishes were that necessary. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's almost the same. Because I don't like dying. Alright. So this will be where the, the killing pit is. Slab those up real quick. And I need... What do I need? Everything. I need to make four campfires again. Why? Because I don't have a silk touch axe. And I needed to move the ones that I had already built. I mean, it's okay. The stuff I need literally goes on trees. Truth.
Those are just so nothing would spawn while I was running back to get campfires. A kingdom for some more durable tools. I'll get there. Eventually. Four books of mending. Well, that too. But I'm not going to put mending on a stone pickaxe. That just, you know. Mm, no one? No one said what? No one said anything. But our Yeti is sleeping Why is anyway. no one talking to us? Huh? You didn't see it in the chat log? Yeah, that's it the no that's one the dot, dot, dot. it's one of the random messages when somebody sleeps. Yeah. Well, that's not creepy at all. <laughs> no, it's like you know the meme so, that I'm waiting for Arcadius to try to explain. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to remember <laughs> one off the top of my head and it ain't coming to me. More coffee. I need more, more coffee. coffee. I believe that is the rallying cry of this entire server. More coffee. <laughs> Must have Truth. coffee. Not even gonna hate. Nope. Nope. Alright. Is that is that's a spawnable area. No, because I, I need to be able to turn that corner, so let's have... So if they come three wide that way, and I were to put just there and there. I need to... get some more fence gates. not doing the job. <sighs> Fine. Alright, let's get bring a stack of spruce logs down here instead of running back and forth. Ooh, I'm running low on spruce. Yeah, I'll do something about that. I need to figure out where I'm going to put the uh, where I'm going to put the tree farm and just what kind of design I'm going to use with that too. Uh, I'm not I'm not building another automatic tree farm. Not in <laughs> not not with these resource constraints. That's for sure. Uh, you got it. Can I say something about our resource constraints? Mm hmm. I'm not trying. I am saying something about our resource constraints. <laughs> I find them too Says constraining. The person for whom's idea this was. Mm hmm. Yep. So I'm probably going to do something a little closer to like what Rendog seems to do, uh, where it's a platform, a, a growing platform suspended over water. CP, CP. Oh, I can't do that. Okay. All right. Um, CP, CP. I can't. It's 11 in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> Why does it look dark? <laughs> because it's raining. it's raining. Well, I don't appreciate that. <laughs> well, the game doesn't, you know, seem to... <laughs> Oh, 
Somebody was about to say unnecessary words. All words are necessary. No, all words are very necessary. You are now rude to language, sir. I said all words are necessary. You should be able to make a chainsaw. Uh, no, no. no. That's that that seems that seems like a bad idea. That Why? that just seems like a really bad idea. I don't think so. All right, Arcadius, go wield that train saw and uh and then train saw? What's a train saw? I want choo a train choo. saw. Ooh, how do you make the cuttery stony thing? Really sounds like a Fallout 4 weapon or some other dystopian <laughs> society's like mass murdering weapon. So, yeah. yeah, I guess it does a little go, bit. Go get the train Cut saw. Cut stony it's thing. Uh, These are no help. Stone and three iron. Three stone and an iron you get on top. Yeah, you, words, they help. <sighs> some people understand me. Well, weren't you the one who was just getting on me about language and words? I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't say that. <laughs> yeah, let's roll back that. <laughs> let's roll back that live stream and uh, what try that What do you think you are, again. the admin or something? <laughs> <laughs> as, as a matter of fact. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, well, I mean, since you put it like that. Telling me what to do like you're the admin. Mm-hmm. Because I'll get better, like, flow out of my stairs if I do it with the stone cuttery thing. Yep. Correct? You will get uh, better results. I don't know about flow, but, but you'll get more for the materials like. used. Okay, that's what I need in my life. Thank you. So, we'll have water coming in that way, water coming in that way, and then one platform is going to be a little off, we'll have water coming in this way. There's a part of me that wants to wall up that last part there so the slimes don't jump into the void because they are that dumb. But on the other hand, if they jump into the void, they'll die in the void. And, uh... And then they'll free up the mob cap for more. Or at least I would think they would die in the void. Since somebody's bees didn't die in the void, it makes me wonder. <laughs> They're just going to be hopping died. down there. I hope they die in the void, because if they don't, I have a whole lot of slime down the void right now. <laughs> uh, by the way, were you on earlier when I... Yeah. I, I still want to talk to you about those slime that hopped across the border and uh, assaulted me. Yeah, I said that was my border patrol. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun. <laughs> All right. How I like it. Do I want to do this? I like your border patrol. Just be overcomplicating this anyway. Is 
we return back to the issue, these things are dumb. Like, Don't you insult that puppy. No, the slimes, not the puppy. Oh. Like, the slimes are, are just one attribute above an armor stand. Oh. Played D and D. That's fairly accurate. <laughs> they just hungry and they wander around. That's all they do. So I, mean, I guess technically, I don't. Uh... And yet, they almost killed a certain group. Hmm? No, they didn't. Or this group. Yeah, I'm not sure what group she's talking about either. Okay, maybe it wasn't the slime. I think it was a black pudding, but point remains. Uh, oh. Those are two very different things. No, they're not. They're still a news. Whatever. Same thing. Same difference. There was sadness. I don't know if I go as far as same difference, but uh, I'm with you on the sadness. Decisions, decisions. Who has decisions? Not me. <laughs> right, they just have to not die. No, they have to die. And quickly at that. They just have to... Why do you think a barrel? Uh, Three planks on either side and a uh, slab at the top and bottom. It's just like a chest but a slab at the top and bottom. Hello, beach duck. Hello, beach duck. Hello, beach duck. Hello, you made that sound like that uh, Seinfeld routine. Hello, Newman. <laughs> I don't think I brought enough cobble. Stairs to be outside the grid. Then they can jump up one block, but not. Two. So that wall should be enough to keep them uh, from jumping out. Ended. We'll jump in there. The big ones can... No, the big ones can't fit because that's not a 3x3. Three three. There we go. 
That is a 3x3. Three three. So they'll fit in there. And hopefully jump around until until they die on top of the fire. Because they, they won't... Can they spawn on top of a barrel? Yes. <sighs> That's annoying. Depends on your objective. To make things spawn proof. Uh, bottom slabs. Or lots of light. I know, but or both. Or I glass. Know barrels. These barrels is the wall. It does really good as either the top, like the molding at the top, or like bracing at the bottom of a wall. Hide it within your stuff. It'll keep it semi, you know, fancy looking. the cactus out of my inventory because I don't need I'm changing that plan I was going to try to break down the slimes before they got here but that's not going to work This is getting too expensive. Too rich for your blood? Mm-hmm. This is getting too wasteful. I think of doing a lot of this with top slabs. And it would be the same net result. So the time chunk is less than 40, right? Uh, you, you say that like it's a given area. Wherever the slime chunk is, spawns will spawn in that chunk at Y level 40 and below. 
No, I'm saying like I could put down regular flooring and just do it chunk by chunk here. Are you trying to find where the slime chunks are? Yeah. Yes. Then, 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 yeah, you could do like I did and just make a little platform until you find out where they are. Because I think I need slimes. No, don't think. Whatever. It is. I want a bungee board. I, I, I suspect it as much. You sound sad. No, I, I'm just curious if this is going to go as you, as you hope it will. It's going to be fun. We'll find out when she starts screaming for someone to sleep. <laughs> uh, actually, that's that's not the part that that's got me kind of curious. Uh, it, it can you imagine making this entire floor a slime pad? So you could fall, and if you are abundantly careful, you could not die of fall damage. No, you don't have to be abundantly careful. You just have to let fun happen. Uh, well, you better build a really big guardrail so you don't bounce yourself off your own island. Yeah, I'm going to have walls. So you're going to make the Funhouse Island? Yeah. What are you doing? Uh, I'll let you know as soon as I figure it out. Okay. You have the hater of Fun Island, apparently. Hating on my fun blob. Blobs. <laughs> are, are we talking about the uh, the? Oh, when did the first one come out? The good one, not 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 the remake. No, 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 no. Like, like you you jump and you hit and bouncy on the thing and go into the water. I don't do it in real life, but I do it in Minecraft. See, Beach Duck thinks it's a good idea. Beach Duck likes my ideas. Mm -hmm. Someone sleep. And someone make these... God, chill. Yeah, that that is one thing that I forgot to uh, write up a little bug report on. I need to remember to do that next opportunity. And let them know that for whatever reason, the COD are counting against the hostile mob cap for the island, for the island's restrictions. You should write that down while we're talking about it. Um, he's also posted a potential 1.17 release of U Skyblock Revised. I am not entirely sure that we want to upgrade just yet, or maybe we do. I don't know. How bleeding edge do we want to be with this? How what? How bleeding edge. I don't edge. want to bleed. Well, nobody wants to bleed. Especially after I got jabbed in the finger by that E-string, but... <laughs> Sounds like a tetanus shot. Oh, no, no. I had just cleaned the string with alcohol. So I got stabbed with an alcohol-infused e-string. Yes, that was as painful okay. as it sounded. <laughs> Might as well have been a square needle.
Oh yeah, I, I guess because I am technically hanging off into Rest's Island. What are you doing on my island? Uh, I am building at the exact border of our islands. And because technically... My hand is on my island. <laughs> my, the edge of my heels is on your island. Oh, is it telling you constantly that you're switching? Yeah. Yeah. I'm on the east side. I'm on, I'm the, on west the west side. side. We should watch that again. It's been forever. It's been a while. Do we need to watch? Robin Hood Men Robin in Tights. Robin Hood Men in Tights. Oh, okay. Because Mel Brooks is a genius. Oh, does everyone want to feel really bad for one of my coworkers? Uh-oh. Maybe. Today, one of them asked me about my favorite TV show. And then started to engage me in discussion about my favorite TV show. Okay. We all know how much I love my favorite TV show. Mm hmm And how excitedly I can discuss such TV show. Mm hmm Yeah. I don't think they were expecting that. They also weren't expecting my answer, so... Well. That was kind of fun. How many people would? Can anybody in chat guess? S take a take a quick stab at uh, what Rast's favorite uh, show might possibly be. There are a couple of people in chat who better know this answer. Yeah, I was getting ready. <laughs> 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 Liking some of those answers. I mean, mm, not coffee not right, craft. But <laughs> I should hope Pinky doesn't need to guess. I've been surprised before, though. Like uh, having a uh, certain thing in camera every uh, <laughs> Minecraft or uh, Coffee Crap episode. I wasn't going to go there. <laughs> I will. <laughs> mm. Oh, of course they are. Then an A? Oh, gosh. Oh, I saw Pink Geek. Okay. I missed your first one, Pink Geek. I was oh. like, hey, what? <laughs> Two people know it. Mm -hmm. For anyone wondering, it is M.A.S.H. I still need to write in to you, uh, cord killers. Why for? Uh, remember when they were doing that live action remake of All in the Family? I. No. I might have intentionally blocked that, though, for my own safety. It was actually pretty good by all accounts. Um, including, I forget who it was, one, one, one of them absolutely flubbed their lines and, and turned dead on to the camera and said, we told you this was real. Oh, <laughs> that's hilarious. And, uh, anyway, it was about that time that I was trying to, I was trying to figure out how to write, um, trying to figure out some recommendations because they were getting they were coming up on the end of one of their library runs where they go through an older TV series and uh, for for spoiler in time and I was sitting there thinking you know my brain making some really weird meanderings no comment hush 
Uh-oh. I don't have to. There are two other people in chat that will for me. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. So, I, it occurred to me that there were some shows that just don't work for spoiler in time. And MASH was one of them. Because when you, when you, when you, oh, of course I can't do that. Um, when you stop and think about it, uh, a show talking about spoilers and plots and things like that really depends on a show that has a plot and a plot arc. And I turn my back for one second. Hi, guys. Hello, friend. You, your turn is coming. I'm sorry. I must have lost track of our conversation at some point in time. Did you say MASH doesn't have a plot? Nah, not in the thing where you can go, well, what? I wonder what's going to happen next week. I mean, are they going to find the MacGuffin? Or, you know, not that kind of plot. Jeez, I turned around for two seconds. Ah, don't worry. I'll get to you guys. So I mean it it's not it's not got a plot in the same way that Breaking Bad has a plot. Where you're gonna go I wonder what's gonna happen next. I wonder how this is gonna work out. I wonder etc cetera, etc. Cetera. Clearly you and I have not been watching the same mash. Uh, I hate to break it to you, but no, it 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 doesn't have. Oh, um, are you okay? Do you, do you, do you need some more slime? I don't have slime yet. I got plenty. I'm trying to build, and they're uh, interrupting. I'll take some slime. The fishies made me fall to my death. How did the fish make me, me fall? They knocked me out of my bubble elevator. They made me, they knocked me out of my bubble elevator. No. Go away or I shall taunt you a second time. What was that, Arcadius? <laughs> I said, and you turn around and there's another one. Uh, not just another one. There's two more. By the way, I still stand by my assessment that uh, y you're not going to get the same kind of plot for spoiler in time out of MASH. Anyway. Um, I was going somewhere with that. Where are they? What? Oh, oh, what are they? They're slimes. They're, they're, they're my whole purpose for building this thing. I'm going to farm these guys. I need slime balls. You get slime balls by killing slimes. Or picking your nose. Either way. Uh, or harvesting panda sneezes. Mm hmm? Exactly. Mm hmm. The, the sneezing what? pandas sneeze out slime balls. No. Yes. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes, yes, they do. You can say no all you want. That doesn't change that they do. <laughs> no. Yes. Every time they do one of their cute little sneezes, like two to three slime balls are on the floor in front of them. Yep. No. Although I don't think it's that many. I thought it was just one to three. I don't know. I thought it was well, same difference. Oh, I don't have to worry about phantoms though. tonight. Why? Ah! Because I died. Ah! No, that doesn't change anything. Yeah. Go on! You got three days from when you start. Doggone it. Yeah, no, I've done this a few times. <sighs> Alright. Feels good not to be the one dying. That's awesome. Oh, uh, hush. <laughs> yeah, because of the three-day buffer thing. When you die... 
You have three days. I need some armor. Uh, <laughs> do I want to use my last two iron for a sword? No, I'm too cheap to do that. Hmm. Hush. What? I heard that. Hmm. <laughs> anyway. So while I was trying to figure out the... the so the, the, the live action bit was going on. I was trying to figure out what to suggest for spoiler in time. And somehow the two thoughts kind of merged. And I started wondering, you know, what about a live action mash using the the Cord Killers family of podcast crew as uh, people? Like, Brian Brushwood is definitely, uh, well, Tom would definitely be Hawkeye. Uh, Tom? What? Tom Merritt? Hawkeye Pierce? Hawkeye. Yeah. No. No? No. And, yeah, I and, see him more as that goofy colonel. And you, you don't see... No. Uh, Potter. You, you, don't, you don't see Brushwood as um, uh, Trapper John? I can see that. Yeah, so I, fi I figured Thomas Hawkeye, uh, Brushwood as Trapper John, and, and then I was starting to think like maybe uh, J Justin is clearly Clinger. I ran out of any more pickaxes. Um, what else? I'm. Why am I... My brain. Why is it not working? Sarah Lane. Yeah, Sarah, Sarah Lane as um, Houlihan. And I was trying to figure out who else to who else to slot in where. Oh, where's my uh, food? gonna stay there for the moment. <laughs> Murphy could be Burns. <laughs> oh, Jason Murphy. Nah, oh, I fig mean. I figured. J <laughs> <laughs> I I, I kind of figured Jason Murphy for more of a uh, uh, Colonel Blake. Jester. Nah, he's a little more Colonel Blake. I would have thought. No. I don't know. Yeah, I can see that. Uh, and Willie, to uh, your thing about not many cliffhangers, I challenge you to watch up to s the end of season, the end of season three, <laughs> and then stop and walk away. Well, okay, that that is a special case there. Okay, how about uh, the caves episode? Only watch the first half. Can't count half an episode. No, it's like no, episodes. like where it's one and two. It's a two episode series, but back then it was like two weeks. You could get bummed, like you didn't. You know, it wasn't like now where you can like binge watch. You couldn't download it off Netflix. <laughs> you couldn't Netflix and chill with it. Yeah. You couldn't Netflix no. and chill when it came out. No, I, I'll, I'll give you no Netflix and chill. So go ahead, watch Caves Part 1, but don't watch Part 2. Like, there are a lot oh. of episodes that had what will happen. No! 
I will agree that some of them, the episode arc in and of itself was not as nail-biting or unresolved as some of Breaking Bad, but I would also say that the character arcs and plots had a little bit more development than some modern series that get covered. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm being assaulted by slime. It's not my fault. Uh, this this is getting ready to sound like uh, a gloom card slain by slime. <gasps> <laughs> he should do a Minecraft edition of gloom. No, go away. I, <laughs> oh, that should be a thing. I said good day, sir. I said good day. <laughs> <laughs> Please, someone write to him and tell him that there should be a Minecraft Here it edition. Comes. Here it comes. What? Number two. We're getting close. Uh-uh. Huh? <laughs> no, because they can't swim upstream. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, that would be pretty funny if he would do that. Ah, I got reach. That's also part of the... Oh, um... <laughs> The dumb AI on slimes is part of why they do so much damage. Because they don't have an actual attack. They, they just do damage by bumping into you. Since they don't have an attack, there's, no, there's nothing to recharge. Their attack is a hip check? Yeah, pretty much. I played soccer, I could go with that. <laughs> You guys can just stay in there. That would be greatly appreciated. <laughs> this little nub of a sword. I smite thee. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, all right, let's try this. I really should have measured this out. done the melon challenge uh a couple i'm at eight yeah i gotta get an actual proper melon farm going uh melon 22 okay so i'm not alone yay also i have one two three four five stacks six stacks oh! seven stacks no eight stacks you stay over there good pod. sir I've been the sugar farmer one 41 times. Yeah, I'm working on like, making my space for that. Yeah, I gotta get my sugar farm back up and running. It stops counting at 64. Oh. That doesn't surprise that's me. That's not okay. I want to do it more, though. I mean, you can you can do them more. It just doesn't count anymore. As far as that's uh, depressing. As far as like how many times you do it, you'll still get the stuff. I don't like the same I am. <laughs> I get it. Sound. Hey, I have more ink. Because <laughs> that's what you needed. More ink. Yep. Oh, hey. Uh-oh. Uh Monsieur Anon, why are you here? Aren't you able to bone meal uh 
Quilts is Coral. concerned about where this line of inquiry is going. Oh! Coral fans. Oh, 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 friend. Oh, What bother. is that? That's a creeper. Uh, I got so it, used to building with bottom slabs that I, I forgot that I haven't put lights in yet. Uh, my, pro my problems keep multiplying. <laughs> well, okay then. We're near my mob farm because that's where I'm headed. Where's my jack lanterns? And I need more slat. I need more uh, pressure plates. I got two coal in a row. I don't think I need that many pressure plates, but... Ooh, gold. Them. Hello. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh! Oh, oh, oh. Uh, this little unintentional mob far of mine. Mm-hmm. It's sad. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, more useless redstone. Hey. You, Mr. Spider. Come on over here. I need string anyway. Oh, What's seriously? <laughs> Are you kidding me? I need string to give me two spider eyes. Oh, you need those two. Not right <laughs> now, I don't. For what? The monster. Holy form. mother of mobcat, Batman. Challenge. <laughs> uh. Sleepies! Oh. Someone sleepies! There's a string. I misplaced all of my beds. Really? <laughs> Somebody's getting pushed into the into the fire. <laughs> Alright, I'll wait for the skeletons and the zombies to die and then <laughs> and then I can try. Oh my. I now have multiple oh. stacks of useless things. Oh, whoa, dude. I told you. What's up with your playhouse over there? Uh, I got so used to building on bottom slabs that I forgot to do the lighting as I went along. <laughs> Good, sir. So all I was really concerned about was the, uh, the, the slimes. The slimes are laughing at you. Not just the slime. You know what? Oh, that. The witches laugh at you. Uh, That's true. I'm just going to walk over... Until I'm far enough away that they despawn. <gasps> Can we get Jabba squeaking a squeaky toy on audio and make that their laugh? When he <laughs> does like the rapid fire squeaky? <laughs> we could honestly do a whole series for a character. Like We could do all of the emotions of squeaky toy. Uh, I, I was actually, <laughs> I was actually wondering about a squeaky toy, uh, as the explosion sound instead of the normal creeper explosion. It could be a lot of things. He squeaks with many emotions. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Although, I, I'm, I'm still wondering if I actually got Arcadius or not. I got home. He was playing Phasma, Phasmophoria. Yes, you did. Phobia. And... and 
Well, I don't know. They seem to like it enough that, that I keep wondering if it isn't Phasmophoria. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, man. The creeper blew up. Oh! How did you jump? Dude! Chunky boy! Uh. <laughs> don't tell him that! Oh, He's sick! Me. Sorry. Uh, anyway, so I, I get home from work. He, he, he's on Phasmophoria, and, and uh, he's asking the ghost or whatever, you know, are you there? I, I'm not sure if he saw me come into the apartment or not, so I go, yes. <laughs> he turns and gives me a look. <laughs> That's mm. lovely. I wish I'd seen that. <laughs> no, what you wish you would have saw was earlier. <laughs> <laughs> We're sitting at the door, and uh, or I was coming out of the truck, and <laughs> that had been hunted a couple of times, and uh, I'm like. I was like, Arcadius, are you getting ready to go back in there? He's like, yeah. I was like, here. And I threw all my stuff on the ground. And I was like, go ahead and do this. <laughs> and I ran back to the truck. <laughs> yeah, like, he literally just emptied his inventory at the front door in front of me and left. And I'm like, R R wait, really? R <laughs> Isn't that pretty much my role when we play that game? <laughs> no, you're the you're the intelligent one. You're the one that sits yeah. in there and, and does the intelligent stuff. Yeah, but the intelligent one usually dies like third in the movie, so... <laughs> That's because they're not as intelligent. They don't have keys to the truck either. No, the problem is they listen to their friends. <laughs> Probably fair. Either they listen to their friends or they don't want to leave their friends behind. So they think if they stay with them just a little bit longer, they can help them. They can't. <laughs> right, I need to get to light. Or they get overconfident and think they already have a backup plan so they can stay just a little bit longer and it'll be all right. It's not. Oh, oh come on. I hate it when that happens. Me too. Oh, question for Anon and Arcadius. Uh -oh. Not medic at first and then medic after. And uh -huh. you'll understand why when I ask the question. Okay. Do either of you know what a jib is? As in, like, as in I the like cut the of my jib? Of your jib or... Yes. I know it's a nautical term, but I forget exactly what. Arcadius? Does this have to do with your uh, workplace funny, not funny? Yes. Not funny, not funny. It just someone said it and was like, do you know where that's from? And I was like, yeah. And then they asked me where, and I told them. And then they were like, well, how do you know that? And like, <clears throat> I think my face might have said, how did you not? Uh, let's be honest. Your face does say things often. Sometimes. All the time. All right, um... Anyway, medic, do you know what a jib is? I do. It, did Would you, you like just ask the navy the guy? The is? Did, <laughs> That's did... why I said he couldn't answer it first. Okay, <laughs> I was just gonna be like, <laughs> it's the forward most sail on a ship. That is, uh, it's like the triangle sail on the front of a ship. You know, you got the big square sails and then the part that goes out to the bow of the ship. You got that triangle one. That's what mm -hmm. that is. 
And that's the one that changes the direction, right? I mean, not like the steering wheel, but like that actually like you can cut it to when you're sailing. Yeah, it's kind of like a front, front rudder, I guess. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, so. oh. Yeah, I just wanted to see if other people knew this thing that apparently was a weird thing to know. <sighs> I'm on, it sounded like me in the uh, nether this weekend. Oh, I saw the server logs. The uh... <laughs> <laughs> did sad things happen? Yes. What sort of sad things transpired? <laughs> or uh... <tedious> sad things. <laughs> Okay, and now I officially have more redstone than I even care what to do with. Um, wait, what, what is the status of what you speak? Like three stacks of redstone? Oh yeah, there's all sorts of stuff you can do with that. That I would, would do with that? Or that is physically possible to do with that? I think the exact term One, was two, good. Three, four. Ah. Okay. That's fair. But I wouldn't, so. But you could. Mm, but I wouldn't. But you could. But it doesn't matter if I wouldn't. Okay. And just because you could doesn't mean you should. Well, I mean... So if I get the water pushing this way. Yeah. Okay. while you in like a cask of Montalato. Ooh, Pink, have you played Phasma yet? Um... One, two, three, four. Pink should play Phasma. Anybody that you really think shouldn't. It's not your thing. It's certainly not Beach Duck's thing. <laughs> well. <laughs> no. Nay, nay. <laughs> Why doth you three. refuse? Why do you protest? I do not understand this refusal. I guess technically I don't need uh, fence gates. It doesn't give you nightmares for very long. <laughs> That's not... <laughs> uh, I, I don't think that's the reassuring uh, you think it is. the center. And one over there, right? Good 
way to hear me scream like a girl. What we got? Two over there? Oh, maybe this is a bad idea right now. Oh. Gas and all. That's, uh, that's not what I wanted. So, Pink, have you looked into it? That side shorter. Duh. Okay. All right. Because I've got an uneven, uneven size. So those push from the corners towards the center. The center down that way. the grids for the moment. Those go around the corner this way. So now I just need to come around the corner this way. Okay, one, two, three, and around the corner. One, two. I have burnt many much cobble. another case of wrong size. pushing towards the center. The back pushes down that way. Hi, friend. I'll get to you. Their little friend, too? Like, I gotta make the... Pl I just realized that uh, I gotta make the platform a little bit taller.
Oh bundles, oh bundles, where are they, oh bundles? Alright. Is the platforms going to be up there? We'll do one there maybe. Ooh, Arcadius, you guys should stream Phasma. That would be fun. <laughs> yeah, we've we've been talking about it as our uh, our Minecraft break stream. Uh, I was actually kind of surprised none of you guys streamed uh, today or yesterday. Oh, I was so tired. We should have done the uh, rollout stream where we all train into this one tonight but i was i was not feeling it i uh, don't don't hear it i'm not saying on that don't, don't smell it i'm not cooking yeah. what is the wrong ah, no. i've never been as fond of that one. <laughs> oh. oh oh no oh no mr bill why for I worked so hard to get back to oh, the weekend. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. That stinks. No, fine. That's and my sad. Good bow. <laughs> oh, baby. You have a sadness, sir. I do. I have no levels to make a new one. Oh. Now that is truly sad. See? I said he had a sadness. That's alright. Piggies are about to give me levels. <laughs> Poor piggies. Give me some more gold armor. Can't go in without the gold armor. Yeah, now, the only problem I have is I still haven't figured out how I'm going to turn this off. I think since there's going to be enough room under there, I might wire in a couple of uh, dispensers with buckets of water as soon as I get, you know, the materials to make dispensers. And buckets. I got rid of everything else before I went down there. So I only lost those two items. Okay. So this platform is done. I would like to try to finish up the wall there. Ooh, yay. Ooh, yay? Yes, yay. I'm super proud that I did not cuss when that happened. <laughs> I can't hear yay or hooray now without thinking of the word pepper. Before oh, I... the pepper hooray. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a modern rogue episode. Look it up if you dare. You, you didn't like the pepper hooray? Um, it's not that I didn't like, I mean, honestly, some of it was a little like, wah, wah. Well, I mean, it is the modern rogue. But. That's what makes it's not that I didn't like sometimes. it, I just, when I hear that, it's just like, huh. That was the thing that people chose to do. Mm -hmm. People who need their vision, like, professionally. <laughs> Ah, I'm out of fence. Like, it, it was almost remini reminiscent of a um, certain series back from our generation. 
where a certain prankster would do very, very dumb, sometimes borderline deadly things for a laugh. Talking about Jack the donkey? Yes. Okay. That's a good way to word that. Should be. I, I actually sat here and thought about it for a solid 10 minutes. <laughs> okay. Wow. <laughs> wow. I'm sitting here going, Jack the donkey? What <laughs> Oh, 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 medic. Okay. Give me a minute, but I got it. Okay. As long as you got there in the end. Got there. So it matters. You know, I'm kind of like after I take my fiber drink. It takes a few minutes, but <laughs> yeah, I get it. <laughs> I was electively ignoring that one. <laughs> Can't imagine why. You were electively trying to ignore that one. Yes. <laughs> Some people are making that relatively difficult. If you guys don't mind tonight at some point log out <laughs> <laughs> i log out every time yeah i i don't i don't have anything set up for afk right now okay there there would be no I, point in me staying logged in i'm specifically talking to arcadius what because, you know i made i made piggies mad again why did you do such a thing uh because i need levels and that requires making people angry? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I got a piggy farm. I was wondering uh -huh. if you did. Yep. Oh. Maybe I didn't want to do... Uh... Hmm. Oh, and Anon. Yes. Just in case it helps you out with some of the pro or some of the, the researching, Sweeping Edge works just fine in the Nether. <laughs> I feel like I missed something. Uh, there's been a, a running issue with Sweeping Edge intermittently not working in the overworld. Uh. But as far as I can tell, I, as far as I can tell, he's the only one having that problem. Unless people aren't telling me things. Would you lie to your no, I'm admin? Pretty, I'm pretty sure I'm the only one having that problem. Because like I said, I gave my sword to Arcadius and it worked for him. Yeah, it's not going to matter who is holding it. It's either working or not. Sword has Smite 4 and Sweeping Edge 3 on it. Mm. Okay. I may end up keeping that, building it up, and we start using that down here instead of my Diamond Sword. I, I think I'll do that. I thought I was being clever with the uh, fences. But not so much. Hey. Oh, hi, friend. Could you? No, could you go into the pit of death, please? That's. 
He doesn't want to. Mm. He said thank you, but he's okay. I'm running out of melon slices. Ow. Uh, they keep hitting me? Oh. Okay. That's what's going on. Melon doesn't have, uh, the kind of saturation to be putting up with that much combat. I don't have the armor to be putting up with that much combat. <laughs> well, that's a completely separate issue. Okay, so that should push them all the way to the edge now. And I'm going to have to replace all that wall with blocks, not... Not wall, because... The chunky boys sit on the edge instead of jumping into the water stream. Because of course they do. At least I found that out now. side is a little bit smaller. Did you not build something well? Um, it, it, no, it's not so much that as it is the constraints of where I'm at. Um, an entire row of dirt disappeared on me. Is it in your inventory? No. <laughs> have had it happen to me where I've planted an entire row of stuff and then that stuff disappear. No, like the row disappeared. Fine. Weird. I made that floor out of blocks instead of slabs like I should have. I'll fix that later because I could go back in and install the dispensers when I get the materials to do that. So. Like real life, <coughs> melon slices are uh, tasty but not nourishing. Well, they're plenty of nourishment, they're just not very filling. I mean, this is the basic idea. That wall's gotta go though, because they can stand on that ledge. The idea is that the AI causes them to jump around, they will eventually make their way into the water, they can't jump back up on here, and I will eventually rig some dispensers in the floor to waterlog this when I want to turn the farm off. I just need to figure out how I'm going to run the signal under there, now that I think about it. Does present a bit of a conundrum. 
spy conundrum. Right. What is your conundrum? It's a problem. stacks of blocks Thanks. stuff and things yep oh, crap. Um, well I guess since I'm gonna do regular blocks and I can tear this down and take some of the stuff back up to why am I taking it all back up there? I'm moving all the storage down here. I think if I can manage it, I'm going to... Since this ladder is in the exact center of the island, or at least the island as it was created, not technically the center of this buildable, air, buildable area, I want to have you drop down here into a circle of workstations and a circle of storage... But, um, let me take care of a couple of things first. Oh, I had a bunch of extra French skates. <laughs> Oops. Sir. I have many needs. Hello, metal and slices. Ooh. Well, that takes care of a small portion of them. <laughs> Put that there for now. I feel like poor Pink has ignored my question. Mm-hmm. Or she forgot your question. Could be. I think she's playing Ark tonight. Ah. If only that was said into a microphone. I think they came out with a new expansion for it, but um, I don't know. After the first time trying to play it, I, it is not very intuitive. <laughs> is it not very intuitive, or are you used to games being easier than that? That's a fair question. Maybe there's a difference between hard and here you're in a world with a T-Rex standing over your shoulder. Yeah, but to be fair... Like, if that were a proximity of uh, how that would actually go down, I mean, let's be honest. That T-Rex going eat good. <laughs> Wait, was that a fed you? you what? Fed? I said nothing. Uh, what do I have stacks? That's legit not what I said. I said that you die. You said he'd eat good. That's not the same thing. He'd eat good because you die. No, what she meant was that you he, that he'd eat good because she knows that where you go, I go. <laughs> it is going. To eat. You only have to be faster than me, buddy. Mm -mm. I don't know. <laughs> Not what I said at all. I just said that your guy's survival skills may be wanting. Maybe That's suspect. What I said. Oh, no, you can't go by that, because my survival skills are pretty awesome. I 
just don't have the physical ability to do that kind of stuff anymore. Mm-hmm. Okay. I used to be pretty big in the outdoors doing my, my bushcraft and stuff. Seriously? You're, you're into, you're into I'm filtering. <laughs> I'm filtering. You got to work on that filter. The uh, the pop-up filter isn't working as well as you think it is. I'm trying to filter. You know, one of these days, Reyes, I will bring out pictures for you. I don't want... <laughs> I'm five. <laughs> You've been hanging around Arcadius too long. <laughs> <laughs> what would you say, medic? Nothing. <laughs> did Did you just realize where her her brain went? Because yeah. I am not explaining that. I'm trying to keep this family friendly. I really am. Some of you do not make that easy at all. I just, you know, for the record. Not my problem. <laughs> he was totally talking about topiaries, children, which are sculpting bushes to look like stuff, kind of like T-Rexes. <laughs> you know, stop it. I can't. <sighs> I just don't think that's a thing you should offer to show your friend's wife. That's all. Topiary skills? Yeah. It's topiary skills. My bushcrafting. <laughs> exactly. <sighs> I'm getting a lot of um, vines off this tree. For serious, dude, go, go back downstream. Go away. I don't want one. Which is good because I need all the hot. Because why are you making this harder than it has to be? Oh my. I think the little ones can reach me, so as long as I just get the big guys. Do I need an invisibility potion to do this? of the void with you guys. All right. Let's try to do this uh, smarter. Huh. I still got to eat the dinners. Are you planning on going tonight? Uh, not too late. Well, that is descriptive. I try. I try to be as descriptive and helpful as I can. I, I, don't I, mean, I, I wasn't even noticing. I didn't even notice what time it was. I appreciate your intense helpfulness. It's a skill I've perfected. 
I noticed. Over many years of study. Actually. I noticed. A lot. Uh, anytime, any day you want to, you know, work on uh, building out that ledge by, <laughs> by uh, where our two islands meet. Which ledge? The, the edge of where our two islands meet. I, I kind of need to get around to that back side of the, uh, the farm. Because <laughs> I'm trying to build this without buying the farm. Oh, so you would like me to uh, work in that direction first? <laughs> <laughs> I, I just I just need a little strip of blocks over on the on the back side so I can is get the you? fence. Hmm? Where is you? I'm the only island next to you. Where is that coming from? Where's what coming from? I have a random water stream that I didn't plan. Uh, water does that. I have an unintended water stream. I don't want it, thank you. Oh, no, 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 no. You get your chunky butt. No. Back, back in the farm. Back in the farm. Um. Excuse me? Back in the farm. No. <sighs> and you talk about how I speak to these creatures. They're worse than Fair. sheep. They're literally dumber than sheep. Mm. No, no, in the game. Their AI is less advanced than the sheep. Sheep actually oh. have pathfinding. These guys don't. Serious people. Go. Look, I'm not there. No player to run towards now. Nothing to see here. <sighs> How did. Excuse you, sir. This is a family-friendly channel. I said nothing but a random collection of phonemes. I feel like it's now your job to explain to the class what phonemes are. Nope. Not my job. If your English teacher didn't explain it to you, then uh, y you should get a refund. I don't know entirely that it works that way. Get away! I can't put the block down with all of you guys there! Making this so difficult. Is that not their job? No, it's not their job. I guess I should have known that they could have landed on the ledge. I, 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 I don't know why I forgot that. Uh, didn't you say something about only sleeping four hours last night? I don't know. Did I? I think so. I think you might have mentioned it once. Or twice. May just be me, but perhaps that might have something to do. Nah, I couldn't possibly impair cognitive performance. 
Not in the slightest. Oh, okay. As long as you let me know that. Thank you for your very informative information. I, I am as well informed as anybody else on Twitter. If only that was said into a microphone. Is that really the standard we're going with? And I'm sorry, I keep turning my mic off. I'm slurping tea over here. Yeah, I, I appreciate you not slurping tea into the microphone. <laughs> I don't. That's the appropriate way to enjoy tea. Yeah. We watched a video yeah, about we, it. Yeah, we watched a video and everything. Mm -hmm. You need to stop slurp shaming, sir. Exactly. You are perpetuating a harmful stereotype. If you guys want to know more about what I want, you need to watch the video. Go to Modern Rogue. <laughs> okay, come on. There we go. There we go. All right. All right. All right. No fishies. But they're so delicious. Not these fishies. I swore the first time she said it, she said feces, and I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't need to happen here. <laughs> <laughs> well, no that either, but... <laughs> Oh, yeah, back to my question from earlier. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> like a long time ago. When you have uh, coral, can't you bone meal it to get uh, coral flowers? Um, well, that was like a hot minute ago. In an ocean. In an, in an, uh, I'm in an ocean, or does it need to be deep ocean? Uh, it might need to be. It might. Need, uh, no, I think it's got to be in the warm ocean, which is not one of the options on our selection thingy. No. Town meeting. <laughs> Unfortunately, that's not one of the things that I can uh, change. This is actually surprisingly <clears throat> productive. Wow. I still got to get some slabs across the top, though. <laughs> I believe I just said town meeting. I heard you. I heard you. I don't know what you want. <laughs> You heard me, you just don't care about my wants or needs? Well, I mean, if we're going to put a number of words on it. Oh, good sir! <laughs> I know who's getting <laughs> smothered with a pillow now! <laughs> yeah. And for once, it's not you. Exactly. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. I thought it was just that one time. It was just the one time. Oh, oh no, no, no! This is not good. This is not. Oh, that's the wrong wall to break out. Um, it totally was just the one time. Promise. Spoiler: It wasn't just the one time. How <laughs> do you know? You don't know that. It could have been one time. And it wasn't my fault that one time. And if it happened any other times, it wouldn't have been my fault either. <laughs> ah, no! Shoot! Dang it! <laughs> oh, I like that one! Oh, there goes my water bucket, too. No, and sadness. all my materials. I was trying to put a cap on the wall for the question that didn't come over the microphone. You still shouldn't carry all your materials. <laughs> That's all the materials for the wall that I was building. Oh, my God. That's not good. <laughs> that, that, that was all the materials for the wall that I needed in my hand to build. Because that's how building works. Sure about that? 
Not as sure as I used to be. That stinks, man. You need a bucket? No. <laughs> I got a bucket. Really? I got a bucket. I've got like five of them because the Wandering Trader keeps selling me puffer fish and they come with a free bucket. How do you guys get Wandering Traders? He doesn't visit me. Well, that's the side effect of having your land all bottom slabbed. You won't spawn on bottom slabs either. I have nice grassy fields next to my palace and some other spots where he, he likes to show. I have grassy fields ish. I mean, they have <laughs> crops on them. Yeah, no, he won't. He won't stop by on the crops. What about on the places that the crops are not because they're waiting for a pumpkin to show up? Good. No. Bad odds on that. Yeah. <laughs> Technically, he could, but. Alright. I got my sword. I got a couple of oh. stone pickaxes. Fishy? We are going to have some words if this behavior continues. <laughs> One fish, two fish. Dead fish, dead fish. All right. Cooked cod, cooked salmon? I haven't found any salmon yet. Just cod. Hi, Axonim. Uh, <laughs> Thank you for slipping into the stream. You missed me slipping into the void. <laughs> it was awesome. No, it wasn't. There was yelling. There, there was <laughs> yelling. To slip into something less comfortable. Oh no 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 negative. <laughs> That's unnecessary. Ah, uh, yeah, I. I I was building that slime farm and I forgot that they would get caught on the edge of the wall. And, um, uh, while I was trying to put that cap around the top to keep stuff from spawning, I got bumped into the void. <laughs> they snuck up behind me and said, hi, y'all. Because I'm building, the two slime chunks I'm building this on are literally at the very outer perimeter of my property. <laughs> no, no, that that that's uh, Medic and Arcadius that have the Netherite stuff. I haven't even mentioned the Nether yet. I do not have any Ow. Netherite stuff, thank you. Oh, I thought you both did. I thought you had a bunch of stuff. No, I'm, I'm the only one crazy enough to be walking around with Netherite. <laughs> what do you mean crazy enough? If I had the Netherite stuff, I'd be walking around with it. Yeah, until you... Burn four gold and four of the uh, thing plus three diamonds accidentally. Get out of the way! Get out of the way! Somewhere. The stair is fun. See what I can finish with, uh, with what I have left. I almost made it all the way around too. Yeah, I th since I had a bunch of walls already made, I thought I was going to use them for the uh, literal walls of this, but uh, yeah, that turned out to be a bad idea. what I can with what I got and then I guess I'll uh, be spending a lot of time grinding this week <sighs> more time than I was expecting
slash I S space home. Right? Maybe. Ooh, I just heard nine gunshots <laughs> right on the street out in front of me. I'll be right back. Uh oh. That sounds be fun. Safe. Good luck. I like how our responses were excessively different. Oh, I see you're building your uh, spiral staircase. Mm -hmm. Nice. Thank you. All right. It's starting to get a little bit less bad. Starting to get a little bit less bad. Mm hmm Okay. I know which company you worked for. You know exactly what that means. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't miss. Mm -hmm. There are a few names I could think of that are on that list. These are a few of your unmissed things. some of the walls back. Are there any other walls over there? targeting me and that's why they're not going in there. Like if I move this way will all the little guys jump to their doom? They will. Because the fishes keep trying to attack me. <laughs> I, I don't think the fish attack you. Yeah, they are. They keep trying to fall on my head. <laughs> and this is not like raindrops. No? <laughs> Negative. God, keep falling on my head. They keep falling. <laughs> yeah, but it's cod. It's not happiness. Okay. And they keep trying to knock me over. I'm doing this already precarious enough without their help. Uh, I know all about precarious.
Do you? Because I'm building a spiral staircase. I do. I'm building inside my slime farm. Oh, yeah, you died a lot doing that. Only twice <laughs> so far. That we have on record. No, only twice so far. Because I started this oh. on the live stream. <laughs> oh, okay. So we'll check tomorrow. <laughs> Is that what you're telling me? Maybe. I just like state. I find Skyblock enjoyable. <laughs> really? Mm -hmm. You sound surprised. I am surprised. I really Why? didn't expect that to be uh, your thing. Oh, well, it is. Hi, friend. I mean, this basic idea does at least work. Um, when I'm not in here messing things up, because there's already two and a bit stacks of slime in there, in the farm right now. How much is a bit? Um... The slimes will show up in a slime chunk on Skyblock. Uh, the U Skyblock revised that we are playing in, every island has at a minimum one. Although, given the fact that you get a 10% chance for any given chunk to be a slime chunk, um, you, you're probably going to end up with more than just the one. Which, in my case, I ended up with like 11 of them. Um, so, slimes will spawn in any slime chunk at Y40 or lower. And then I built a platform for them to spawn on, and the idea is the water streams will push them to their death. The problem is, that little lip on the edge of the wall, they'll actually jump on that, and it'll keep the water from pushing them to their death, meaning... Uh, they don't die as quickly as I really need them to to free up the mob cap. So I, I'm trying to fix that, but the problem is uh, you skyblock, you can't build outside the perimeter of your island, and that wall is at the absolute very last edge of my perimeter. <laughs> You know, just to make life interesting. Flaxenim, I didn't know that you had a shirt person in your household. Do they game a lot too? <laughs> nice. <laughs> Has that been a uh... Has that been a point of contention? <laughs> okay, or... I was about to ask if that had been a point of contention But I believe uh, that statement in and of itself May have answered that question Are you guys back in, like, normal life office stuff now again? Or did you guys go back into lockdown? 
Oh, Grandma doesn't have an Xbox. Oh, oh. <laughs> their life is so hard. <laughs> Hashtag first world problems. Ah, uh, to be a kid again. And your biggest concern was who had the gaming system at home. That sounds rough. Mm, I'm sorry to hear that. I, I might actually finish this. Oh. <laughs> I, I've worked for a couple of companies that would do stuff like that. Oh, we weren't. Yeah. No, we've actually done those. Uh, I've not actually done it, but it's been close enough that it might as well have been. No, I have literally... Yeah. Yeah. Uh, somehow that doesn't surprise me. I don't miss that place. Oh, and this is going to be fun. Okay. You guys stay over there. That's it. It only cost me everything. You did a thing? I think, I think it is finally done. Although I'm not going to call it done until I actually get out of here alive. That's fair. But I fixed the wall. That should be high enough that they can't jump out. Uh, unless they're targeting something. Which they shouldn't be. Because they shouldn't be able to see out. Well, if I need to, I can always raise it a little bit more. Well, raise the roof. Raise the roof. Yeah, I'm about to... Oh, I feel like that was not said with the appropriate inflection. Uh, because I'm about to face the unfortunate consequences of choices. Oh, I'm sorry. We'll miss you. <laughs> Thanks. I'm not sure that I believe that. I would. You know what? That's okay. I, I can live with uh, losing a couple of materials at this point because I've lost so much more. Materials. To be Pride. fair, XNM, I'm his younger sister, so of anyone here, I probably have, well. <laughs> yeah. Certain questioning may be more reasonable. <laughs> yeah. I hate that I lost that many, uh... Jeez. Oh, there we go. Come on, guys. That's it. So. I think uh, anyone who has a younger sibling can attest. <laughs> That, that, that's not a bad bit of slime, just for that little bit of collection there. 
as two, four, six, seven, seven and a quarter stacks. Seven and a third. Give it a minute and, uh, oh, no. We're, we're at better than seven and a half, just while I was sitting there trying to count it up. And that's with me <laughs> eating a lot of mob cap right now. Uh, yeah. Now, that is that is the one thing that I will have to go back in there to fix as soon as I get the materials. I need, I need to build an off switch. I, I need a way to, to turn, to turn the farm off. Um, yeah, so as soon as I get the materials for dispensers, all the only thing I'm not sure about is how I'm going to uh, wire in the wire in the dispensers. I was originally going to try to work it underneath the platform, but I have nowhere upon which to uh, run the wire. Because the water's running on that level there. I, I, hmm. That's called a problem for another day. That's called a problem for another cool. day. <laughs> oh, oh, almost eight stacks. <laughs> just, just while we're musing. All right. I'll declare that a success, though. I'll declare that a success. Although I guess if it keeps killing them as quickly as it is, that shouldn't hurt the mob cap too, too much. Oh, remind me, what does a slime farmer give you? A redstone ore and an emerald. I mean, all right, I'll do that a couple times. Because I need the redstone ore for sure. Uh, 88. Oh, no. But I don't want to burn through too many slime. Because, uh, I do need those for other projects, too. Come on, sleepy, please. Oh, oh, I will as soon as I get the stream archive uploading. Oh, that's not what you meant, was it? I guess I got a lot of grinding in my future. Next, I need to get the measurements for the mob farm. Because I am going to put together a hostile mob farm probably in that area right there. Or that area right there. Depends on how much space I need to make it to make it happen. Uh, it is going to be a little bit different design. Uh, but something definitely AFKable. I mean, I, I should probably, I should probably actually do, do something that requires player intervention first, just so I can get the uh, potatoes and carrots from the uh, from the zombies. Should, but I probably won't. Um, <coughs> also, the zombies will drop iron on occasion, and that would be a nice way to get iron until I can get a zombie villager. But. Probably not. Yeah. I need measurements. And then on one of the slime chunks, I'll build my cactus farm. Because it is a farm that I know will not uh, provide spawnable spaces for slime. And uh, that that should be the good one. Because the, the cactus thing gives you sand, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I'm definitely going to, you know, so instead of turning that in when it uh, next ticks up, I'm going to use that to, to make a giant cactus farm. Where's the rest of my sand? Yeah. I, I will take every bit of <laughs> the 26 sand that I have and make that as large as I can. So... 
Oh my. The, 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 this is close enough for those guys to spawn. I guess I should have made that opening a little bit wider. Why huh. are they bumping each other out of it? Yeah. The 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 chunky boys are uh keeping each other from uh their their inevitable fate. But that's the basic idea. The water pushes them into that little chamber. Uh, I didn't want to use 3x3 three three hoppers because I don't want to devote 9 hoppers to a, a, any single farm. Uh, I could use magma blocks to trim their size, but I need to get to the nether first, and I'm not there yet. Uh, honestly, there, there's a design that I would have rather have used that requires 8, eight to 10 magma blocks, but uh, we, we return back to I don't I don't have that just yet so I'm gonna see how this goes and if it's going good enough I, I may I may just build up a few more floors of that Are you positive you built this all the way to my border yeah yeah okay. the the smooth stone at the end is the outermost edge of my island okay. it's funny you can't render, but the blocks you're placing can. So it looks like a cobblestone walkway is slowly growing out. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> wow. Okay. All right, it is late. It is almost 10 o'clock, so uh, this is where I go to the credits. And I stuff my inventory with stuff so that people don't throw things randomly. Not, not that anybody in our group would ever do something like that. And I say thank you for joining along. I hope you had fun. Uh, a little more rambly, a little more disorganized than normal. I apologize. Four hours of sleep will do that, uh, even even with coffee. Uh, next week, we we're gonna build a mob farm. I'm I'm probably gonna go ahead and start the uh, the outlines of it because what I have planned is big. I'm probably gonna have to spend the rest of the week uh, grinding that out. And if I don't have the materials for the mob farm. It will be the cactus farm. Uh, once I have those two down, I will then be able to put it in the tree farm and start going from there and just kind of building out from there. And uh, this will this will this will snowball and get rather big rather fast once we get more and more of the the automated farms in place. Uh, especially once I get a couple of villagers, that that'll make life a whole lot easier. But um, thank you for joining along. We I stream on the Coffee Craft server every Tuesday at 6.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern. Medic and Arcadius also stream on the Coffee Craft server uh, at least once a week, sometimes more. So if you haven't already, give them a follow as well. And all my live stream archives go up on my YouTube channel. I, I, will, I will get to producing more episodes. I... I I gotta get my life together. <laughs> I gotta get my schedule together. No, I said it right the first time. Uh, I gotta get my schedule together and, and try to work in a routine. So for now, look for the episodes. Just don't expect them on a schedule. And uh, hopefully I'll be getting more stuff up there too. Enough rambling. Let me see who is available for a raid. Uh, oh, Beast Lord isn't on anymore. All right. Badness. Then let's go raid Grimly. Uh, Beast Lord J and Grimly are like my top two people to raid because they are wonderful people. You should follow them both. Uh, eventually, when, when I get my schedule together, I will get the chat commands to, <laughs> to do some of that. Uh, squared away. 
So let's go raid Grimly. I'm going to pop up the title card. Stick with me. He is playing New World. So let's go see what that's all about. Stick around. 